Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, this is Planet Coaster. Hey guys, so we got something new for you today. Um, I've watched this game for quite a while. I watched Silverette, I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly, and I watched a lot of B-double-O play this game. Um, and I always wanted to play it, but up until recently, I never got the chance because my old computer wouldn't run it, but I upgraded that, so now that we can run this game, um, I started playing it, and we got a little bit done here. I like this section of the park here. This section over here was where I started, and this is all going to be redone eventually. I just put down a bunch of stuff to start making some income, and now that I got my income going, we're going to start working this out. Um, trying to make it more plaza-like, a little more organic, free-flowing. I was going to do a sci-fi amusement park, but I decided that the whole thing being sci-fi just might be too much. So right now I'm going for a little bit of a fantasy fairy tale, I guess. Something like that. Castles, knights, pavilions, tents, all that kind of stuff. Um, so it's going to be a little bit more like just a theme park than an amusement park rather I guess more like Disney or something um, we're gonna clear out these rides and do a little bit of a main street area down here put the castle down there at the end kind of like Cinderella's castle and then we'll do sci-fi we'll do pirates area all that kind of stuff so it should be fun with that being said let's jump right into it all right so this area over here ooh, that's loud. Um, so this area over here we had a lot of trash because I only had one janitor and I didn't realize that I only had one so I just put a new one and he's hard at work so let's keep going I think I'm gonna do some scenery stuff today get these cues going and then next time I have plans on building a cool roller coaster um, let's do some research here let's crank that up quite a bit and sorry if you guys can hear the mouse clicking a lot. I currently don't have a shock mount for my mic yet, so you may hear some stuff, but bear with me as it'll get better. Oh. Shit. Wrong button. It's looking pretty good so far. We keep adding to it and whatnot. This I like a lot too, so let's paint that some. Put a little bit of gravel in. There's some other grass in there. Yeah, I watched some uh, Silverette videos on how to make nice flowing plazas. He's doing a great job with his Planet Coaster College tutorials. Pretty, pretty awesome. You never have enough trash cans because everybody in this park is just filthy and just throws their shit right on the ground.
Alright, so let's move this guy. Hello? No. I would like to move you, please. Thank you. Talk back here just a little bit. Open it back up. And what I plan on doing is building off of this building on around it. So maybe let's get into that. Let's see if we can't make this potty look pretty. So let's get the building. Custom. wall pieces. Fun. Don't forget to be an edit building or your stuff won't build on it properly for whatever reason. And then it's annoying. So let's build that. Sure, that'll work. Okay. I think we're going to miss this one just a little bit here. Hmm. This is the only thing that sucks is when you're building on the building, you're restricted to the grid. So what we can do here, is ditch this guy, ditch this guy, in front of it, ditch that guy, wall. here and here. Now when we go across. Back. Maybe. No. Excuse me. What are you doing? There we go. Boom. Perfect. That will work. Alright. So let's keep going with our walls then. some of these trees for a moment so we see what the hell we are doing
Alright. So now at least that fits in with there. We can always add on something here later down the road. We don't have to. We could just do scenery. We kinda of do whatever we want. And it's the pleasure of this game. I think I may actually leave these trees out of here. They were really obstructed the view. Let's put that fish on the ground. <laughs> Yeah, so that looks a lot better, like that, that that guy has, that's a cool looking window. Shutters. All right. Just try to make all this stuff kind of flow together and match nicely, right? Oh, how did you get that so bright? like they put a little planter box on there. Don't have to copy it 100%, so we'll just leave it how it is there. Pretty happy with that. It's looking pretty nice. Okay, done. Let's just put another rock right here. It would be nice. Rotate job. Perfect. Good. He looks happy on that corner. Yes. I love these little guys for just filling in areas. They work wonderfully. Right there, uh huh? So we got rid of these trees here because it was really blocking the view of this. I think I'm going to take a couple of these little pink trees and plop a few in there just so this area all kind of looks uniform. Uh, yeah, that'll look good.
And then off camera too, I changed out that bathroom sign. I couldn't find this one the first time. So I finally found it right after I stopped recording for a minute. This crap is breaking down, which is fine because we're going this way now. So I don't so much care about these rides over here right now. So we'll get to that stuff in a little bit. You see my broken down castle that I didn't quite complete because that coaster kind of sucks. So I'm going to build a new coaster, I'll build a new castle around it or something, figure out something. So let's place a couple more rides, see what we got here. How's our research going actually? Oh, it's almost done. Okay, let's start a research here, a thrill ride. Yeah, let's do this guy. Awesome. Let's research an ATM too because people get more cash out in the park, they're likely to stay in the park and spend more money. All right. So that we can get rid of this old ride, let's put another one down over here so that it works well. Where do we want to put this one? We got two rounds there. So let's put this guy. Uh, yeah, let's put this guy right here. Bring it cue this way, I think would be nice. So we'll put that there. Just place an exit right out front. Let's not go out so far so that we have a little bit of room to decorate in between that and the ride beside it. It looks good. Okay. So let's take our path tool. Let's leave that for a minute. Let's take our path tool. It makes some nice new pads. Maybe make it smaller just a little bit. That'd be nice. It's going to length up just a little bit so we can get some nice flowing. Mm -hmm. That looks good. Okay, and this took me forever to figure out. If you hold control, you can start a new path instead of making it build off of the end of the old path. That was so annoying to figure out, or until I figured it out, rather. So let's move back over here. I'm gonna come right off the side of this guy. Like so. Turn the length down just a little bit. This. And then back into that guy. Gives a nice little plaza and we can put some more rocks or trees or bushes or something in here. It'd be just fine. So then we need to connect a path here. That kind of looks cool. So let's try that. And if you put something in the corners and then delete it, 
it kind of like rounds it off a little bit, gives it a nice look. See, so that whitened that out, makes it look nicer. Do it again over here. Just trying to get rid of those sharp edges. Oh, shit, nope. Oops. What? Why are you doing that? No. Okay, I guess he's happy there. Um, we'll just break that up just a little bit so it's not so big. And then, yes. Why are you doing that? Okay. Try it here, maybe? There we go. That looks much better. Just nice flowing, maybe here, can we? Yes. No. Hmm. Okay. I guess that wasn't because of this or something, maybe. So, alright. Anyways, that's good enough. So, let's get this guy going. People start riding it. Do some bushes real quick. I'm telling you, I'm a sucker for these bushes. They're just such great ground cover. Just fill in an area quickly, and then you can accent with other little plants. Zoom in here a little bit so we can see what's going on, right? Ooh, that would look nice. Kind of match the other little plaza down there. Raise you up a little bit. Okay, then we'll go to terrain and paint that just so it doesn't look there we go. All right, so let's just go over here. We have both these rides, so we don't need two of these. So let's ditch this guy. Yeah, see, he's super old, built near five, so that thing's seven years old. It just breaks down all the time. So let's get rid of that guy. Poor people. Oh, they just disappeared. Usually they just walk back onto the path that time they disappear. That's kind of funny. All right. So let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of all this stuff. My goodness. There we go. Looks better. So we're going to keep clearing this stuff out. This will be the next ride that we rebuild over on this side of the park. And then we're going to come down this way next. Um, we just went to Disney a couple months ago. And I got some really good pictures of the Norway area. My daughter's obsessed with Frozen stuff. Uh, we did the ride and met on and Elsa and all that kind of stuff. Um, so I think I'm going to do some Norway style buildings. I got a lot of pictures. There's like a couple really big rocks in that area. Um, so I think that's the next thing we're going to start doing is I'm going to build a little area probably back over here by this merry-go-round carousel. Um, do a couple Norway style buildings. And then probably in the next episode we're going to start building a coaster. I'll we'll demolish this guy soon because it's just old and beat down like these guys um i did find out a neat thing actually that if you click on the ride and you go to the mechanics or maintenance you can request inspections and you can also request a refurbishment which i was like this is so stupid all these rides keep breaking down how are you supposed to keep up with this so I found out that you could just request a refurbishment and it makes them newer, which I guess I could do on this one, but I'm not very happy with this coaster. I just threw something together, like I said at the beginning, to start generating revenue. Um, and I'd really like to start doing a wood coaster. I think that I'll save for Norway. 
So maybe we'll wait on the Norway part until I get a wooden coaster researched, and then we'll we'll go for building Norway because I think a wooden coaster would fit in really well over there. And I'm going to start working on a little bit of color management, like you have pink and pink here, and then you got green and green here, which looks pretty nice. I might paint this guy up a little bit. Um, I just want everything to look kind of uniform in certain sections of the park. I mean, we have a long ways to go here because this map is pretty big. I mean, I heard somebody yesterday say this is like the city skylines to roller coaster tycoon kind of. Um, and I agree with that wholeheartedly. I mean, just the amount of stuff that you can do in this game is incredible. So I'm going to leave this episode right here. If there's something you guys want to see, drop a comment below and we'll see what we can get done. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.